Hey everybody, I'm back with yet another video and today I'm going to be continuing the conversation on decisions where I'm going to be focusing on this question, why do people avoid making decisions? So I wanted to stay right till the end of this video because I'm going to be sharing some of my personal experiences and I think this is going to add a lot of value to you and at the end I wanted to make sure that if you like this video please subscribe, like it, comment, share it with as many entrepreneurs as possible so maximum people benefit from it. So. Let's answer this question. Why do people avoid making decisions? I'll tell you the answer straight away. Because decisions gets them outside their comfort zone. Think about it. You know, every decision you make dictates the direction of your life. I've said this even before. And there are certain decisions which you make takes you towards your goal and certain decisions takes you away from your goal. Now, if a decision which you're making is taking you towards your goal, because it's towards your goal, obviously it's not meant to be easy. Obviously it's going to be challenging and obviously it will get you outside your comfort zone. That's the way it is designed. If it wasn't getting you outside your comfort zone, you would have probably hit your goal right away. That's the logic about it. But here's the honest truth. Human beings hate making decisions. Why? Because decisions, like I said before, gets them outside their comfort zone. And a human being's brain is designed to keep you in your comfort zone. So the brain will give you multiple reasons, justifications, which are extremely valid, logical and emotional in nature to stop you from getting outside your comfort zone. That's basically how it works. But unfortunately, that's not how decisions are made. And getting out of your comfort zone is very critical for it to be successful. Let me share an experience I had where I had to make a decision which got me outside my comfort zone. You know, I started Quantum Leap in the year 2006-2007 along with my business partners Rajiv and Pranav. And we had a pretty good run at that point of time. We were fairly successful and we, we were trying to really scale up. And in the year 2009, I started my second business. In the year 2010, I started my third business. In the year 2011, I started off my fourth business. So I was running four business ventures and I thought I was doing well. Okay, because you know, I was making a decent amount of revenue. We had a decent amount of clients, but bottom line, was I making any money? No, it was like I was running four jobs and it wasn't achieving the objectives I had for myself for being a serial entrepreneur. I had no time, I had no money. And at the end of the day, I was going in circles. And the year 2012, the biggest debacle of my life happened where I lost two of my business ventures, they went bust and I found myself into a 45 lakh rupee debt and a 70 lakh rupee loss and honestly it was probably the biggest breakdown I've ever had so far and uh, it shook me completely and from 2012 to 2014 I was searching for what is the answer which will give me the solution to my problem, how do I get out but no matter what I tried, I just kept going round and round in circles. Let me give an analogy. If you've ever seen a zoo before and you see an animal in a cage, you notice that the animal does not try to escape. You just go round and round and round and round. Why? Because they know that's their life, that's their limitation. They're not going to try to get outside their comfort zone and try to jump over the cage. Well, you know what? That was me. I had no clue what to do and I just kept going round and round and round and round. But 2014 October, a very interesting incident happened for me and my business partners which really got us to question and get aware that we are in this comfort zone and the only way out of this is for us to learn and fill in the gaps of the missing capabilities we had because of which we weren't successful. And we had to invest in our learning to upgrade ourselves and at that point in time we had no money, we were already in debt. But we took that decision to get outside our com outside that comfort zone and invest in our learning. That decision cost me 40 lakh 67 thousand rupees. A very, very, very outside my comfort zone. Please remember that I was in a 45 lakh rupee debt and a 70 lakh rupee loss. And most people would tell me that, I mean, what the hell is wrong with you? Are you crazy? Why would you do something like that? You rather invest it back in your business. But I was very clear that my track record before that uh, was not really supporting me and if I would have invested in my business that money would have gone down the drain and was it also my comfort zone yes but hardcore I made that decision because I knew for a fact that that's the only way for me to reach my goals and from 2014 to 2016 uh, we pulled this off it was not easy and we invested in our education upgraded ourselves and today we're in 2020 and I'm running one of Southeast Asia's largest training and coaching companies and holding more than a thousand entrepreneurs across 180 domains uh, and train more than 5,000 business owners how to scale up their business and 
I look back and see is that one decision which I made in the year 2014 precisely which got me where I am today because I decided to get out of my comfort zone. So the reason why I'm sharing this experience with you is because I want you to know that uh, the most, the biggest reason why business owners avoid making decisions is because of the comfort zone. But it's designed so that you get outside your comfort zone because that's when you're building muscle. I keep saying this to people. You know, when you go to the gym, you're going to exercise. It's going to hurt. There's no two ways about it. But it's hurting when it's paining. It's working because you're building the muscle to take on the world. That's what getting outside your comfort zone really means. You can't just go back and say, you know what is paining and I don't want to go to the gym back tomorrow. That's how decisions work. So make your decisions because you know for a fact that the whole point of it is to get you outside your comfort zone. If you like what I shared with you, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you get access to all my videos. Make sure you hit the like button, make sure you comment and share this with many entrepreneurs so that they can also gain value. And in the meanwhile, I want you to take care and I'm going to see you in my next video.